Hey guys! So I got an exciting package in the mail yesterday. I ordered a lipstick tower because I have a lot of lipsticks and not a lot of space to put them in. So instead of taking up all the real estate on the dresser or the um, vanity, I want to build upwards. Um, so I went back and forth kind of between Zara and um, a company called Lady Moss. Um, I don't know, it, it doesn't seem to be as popular on YouTube and everything. I don't know why because this tower is amazing. Um, it holds more lipsticks. It's very well made. I mean, it, it, so I'm so excited. Um, and let's see, it, the price of it is originally, I mean, it's regularly $99. Um, and with, I got it for $80 and free shipping. So yeah, right. It was on sale. I don't know if it's still on sale. I'm going to link, I'm going to link it below so you can, if you want to order it, I'm not affiliated or anything. It's just, I just think it's amazing. So let me show you. Um, I did open it and look at it yesterday, but I wrapped it back up because I felt bad. I wanted to do an unboxing, but I am way too impatient for unboxings, so I apologize. But I, I wrapped it back up because I want to show. I wanted to show you how it came. Okay, whoa. So here's the box. an inner box here. Let me get this out. And it has lots of bubble wrap in the box and it's wrapped in bubble wrap. Okay. And they have an option. They have um, white, they have clear, and black. I think those are the only options, but I'm not sure. So then open this box. And it's wrapped in a little bubble wrap. And we open a little bubble wrap. And it's wrapped in plastic. And take plastic off. I mean, it was wrapped really well, so it took me a while to get into it. So, okay. So here it is. Look at that. It's so gorgeous. It has the little Lady Moss logo on top and it has space for small, like I guess lip glosses and then the larger lipstick tubes. And then I think it holds like 116 if I'm not mistaken. And I know the Zara one is a little bit less. It's like, um, each little segment holds 12, and I think with the Zara's, each segment holds nine. So you do get more. Okay. And I brought, I brought some little lipsticks over, um, different shaped ones, just to show you how they fit. I don't even know. I haven't messed with this yet, so I have no idea how, how, how it fits. Um, I'm not going to put them in the lipsticks in here because my vanity is in the bedroom, so, and right now it's all full of furniture. It's just a mess, so I will insert a picture after I'm done filling it so you guys see what it looks like. <clears throat> Or a little video clip or whatever. All right, so let me just maybe move the camera so you guys can see. Hello. <laughs> okay. So here we go. Now I have some Mac lipsticks. You guys know what these look like. So you can just kind of, oops, wrong way. Hang on. Put them in like this so that you can see names okay now these are Japan these are from Japanesque and they're a little bit thicker so I wanted to see if these fit yes as you can see 
they do fit. You see, oh yeah, and they, they fit up top as well. Oops. Sorry, Max. I'll take those out. They do fit up top as well. Um, now I have some, another odd kind of shaped one. This is um, lip bar, and it's a little bit larger. Okay, and that, oh, it actually does fit. Okay. Yeah, it does fit. I wasn't sure. Now it's not going to fit up top because it's square and these holes are round, but that's okay. And then I have a couple Sonia Kasha, which are kind of long. I wanted to see what the long ones look like. Okay, yeah. So they, they do fit. They stick out a little bit, but I don't mind that. And no, they don't fit in the square ones, but that's okay. So I just kind of wanted to show you a couple, you know, how they looked. But I'm going to fill it, and I will insert a clip, a video clip. I'm so excited. It's so pretty. <laughs> okay, welcome to my mess. <laughs> see, as you can see, I have quite a few lipsticks and lip glosses. And I went ahead and kind of organized them as well as I could. Um, the one problem that I did find is the ones that are a little bit shorter. Um, when I put it in there, I had to fish it out. I had to literally get tweezers to fish it out. So just be mindful that if you have short ones, like these Ulta ones are kind of short. I just put those up top. So, yeah. And... So yeah, I have you know L'Oreal and you know what I got here. NYX. It's kind of Mac. No, these are yeah. No, I don't have my glasses on, so I can't see. But yeah, I just kind of put them, you know, in order by brand, pretty much. I'm gonna go in um, color order. I need to um, catalog these in my Snups app. Um, if you guys have never heard of Snups, you need to get it. I mean, if you can use it for anything, you can um, use it to inventory absolutely anything. So if you guys are on Snups, it's S-N-U-P-P-S. I'll link it below. Um, look me up. I'm Hammy Mama, and I am inventorying everything that I have. I've already done my palettes and um, like my single eyeshadows um, and these like quads and all that. I still haven't like done the pencils or anything like that but yeah I need, I need to find out. I need a record of what I have because sometimes I buy you know doubles of things and uh, this will help you know I'll be able to open my phone and see exactly what I have and so some of the other organizers I have I have one of these like stadium kind of <laughs> I don't even know what you call it but I got this from Amazon two of those um, these are just these are old party light um, crystal containers I have two of those and I have a, um, got this lip gloss holder from Amazon. Really nice. And, but that one, I mean, it was, it's not a buy allegory, but it was still like 18 bucks. That's why I want to make my own because I have all these lip, lip glosses. Now these, I got this. I have two of these. These were, um, $9, $9.99 or something at container store so love these they're actually in the, um it has a top but not, i don't use it <laughs> see i had two of them this one and this one um they're really nice heavy acrylic and they're in the bathroom sorry the bathroom section of um the container store so i highly recommend those and really nice for putting your pencils in 
so and I have my color pop so yeah those, those are really really nice and these I also got at the container store I have a lot of those they have like little rubber stoppers on the bottom so that's it and then of course the palette holders these I got from container store as well I got them on sale for like $7.99 they're regularly $9.99 but they're really pretty <sighs> okay so that's that's kind of my storage as of right now but I definitely I need to get this stuff cleaned up because I have just all this stuff over here and you know I, yeah it's a mess so I am also planning on making one of these you heard right I have all the parts to it I started kind of making it a little bit I have another little small camera that I'm using because it auto focuses and I have a little bit of footage on there but I need to it's kind of like a work in progress kind of thing so I am planning oh and then one more thing I need to tell you about this it's sharp <laughs> when I was reboxing this yesterday I cut my finger I have a cut it's like a deep paper cut kind of thing so the plastic you need to be careful it's a little sharp okay um, and then the other DIY project along the same lines is I want to make a lip gloss holder so it's going to be a box like this and I'm going to um, my husband and I are actually going to make it I'm going to film it so um, it's going to be a box a little bit taller and it's going to have dividers and it'll hold lip glosses because I, there's, I mean, there are some lip gloss holders like by Allegory, but they're a little bit expensive. So anyway, let me shut up. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm going to link Lady Moss down below. If you're interested, I highly recommend this tower. So thank you all for watching. See you in the next video.